morning, Park Cubs. Today is Tuesday, April 26, 2022. I'm Cameron. And I'm Liz. Welcome to the Cub Report, your daily source of information for what's going on here at Park. The Cub Report is our way of letting students, staff, and families know everything that is going on here at Park and to create a better connection among everyone. For lunch today, in addition to the usual items, in the center station, we will be having French toast sticks, sausage, and hash browns. Please remember that if you don't have an ID, you'll need to buy a new one for $5 in the office. If you are unable to purchase one, you can talk to one of our administrators about getting on a contract to work for a new ID. Thank you to everyone who participated in our Walk for Water, Popcorn, and Hat Day fundraisers last week. We will continue fundraising throughout the rest of the year and to try to raise enough money to build a well in Kenya so the students there can spend their days at school instead of walking for water. We will be doing another popcorn sale tomorrow in the cafeteria at all three lunches, so be sure to bring one dollar if you like to buy some. We will also have another half day this Friday. Again, it will cost one dollar to wear a hat and students will need to come to, to the cafeteria between 7.30 and 8 to pay their dollar and get their wristband. 6th and 7th graders who turned in the ASB applications, Mrs. Kelly is revealing all of the applications this week and will let you know whether or not you've been approved by next Monday, May 2nd. Remember that our carnival themed ATP event and talent show are coming up on May 12th. Students who are interested in the talent show need to apply online as soon as possible. Talent show auditions will take place on Thursday, May 5th at 2.45 p.m. after school in the cafeteria to determine whether or not they will be able to perform in the event. The week of auditions, Ms. West and Mr. Garza will send out an email reminding students who applied when and where to meet. Students will know whether they will be participating one to two days after the auditions. It's time for a sports update. Coach Blake's softball team had a great game against Carmichael last Wednesday. They had some great plays and got some outs and even struck out some players. Coach Blake is so proud of you. Keep up your hard work, Cubs. Speaking of sports, our administrators would like to remind all students of a few things. First of all, campus is closed when there are games going on. If you are on campus during sporting events, you must be watching the sporting event, not on the hill, the blacktop, or near the building. If you are there to watch a game, you should be watching respectfully. Remember that you are representing Park, so you should still be following school expectations. Also, please remember that when you are watching games, you should not be distracting the players. They are there to play their games, not to interact with spectators. Our quote of the week is, you owe it to yourself to become everything you've ever dreamed of being. If you have any thoughts, suggestions, or shoutouts for the cover report, send them to bit.ly slash park cub report submission. That's all for today, Cub. Have a great day, and remember, all children are capable of success, no, no exceptions! exceptions.